Welcome back to the Community Corner Podcast, where we explore S500 companies through the lens of behavioral finance. I'm Arnav. And I'm Nikhil. Today's focus is on Enphase Energy, a leading company in solar energy and storage solutions. We'll examine how behavioral finance influences their strategies, market adaptation, and investor perceptions. Let's dive in. Enphase Energy operates in the renewable energy sector, focusing on solar technology and energy storage. How do behavioral finance concepts like optimism bias and the endowment effect impact their strategic decisions, particularly in areas like technology innovation and market expansion? Optimism bias can influence and phase energy strategic decisions by driving them to pursue ambitious technology innovations and market expansions with a positive outlook on their success. This bias might lead them to overestimate the potential benefits of new technologies or market opportunities. The endowment effect can also play a role, as in phase might place a higher value on their existing technologies and solutions, potentially affecting their willingness to explore alternative or disruptive innovations. Enphase's focus on managing these biases reflects their effort to balance optimism with realistic assessments of market opportunities and technological advancements. This approach is appealing to investors who value both innovation and practical risk management. Exactly. Enphase's ability to manage biases like optimism and the endowment effect while pursuing technological advancements and market opportunities makes them an attractive option for investors seeking a balance of growth potential and realistic risk management. Let's discuss diversity, equity, and inclusion day at Enphase Energy. With its focus on renewable energy, how do DEI efforts intersect with behavioral finance for them? DEI initiatives are crucial for Enphase Energy, especially given its global operations and focus on innovation. From a behavioral finance perspective, a strong DEI strategy can enhance decision-making by incorporating diverse perspectives, leading to more innovative solutions and better market adaptation. For investors, Enphase's commitment to DEI signals a socially responsible and inclusive company which can enhance its reputation and appeal. Additionally, DEI efforts can help attract and retain top talent, contributing to long-term success in a positive company culture. Investors increasingly value DEI when evaluating renewable energy firms as diverse teams can improve innovation and market adaptation. That's right. Enphase's focus on DEI not only improves internal culture but also strengthens its market position and appeal to socially conscious investors. Moving on to market adaptation, Enphase operates in the dynamic renewable energy sector. How does the company adapt to different market conditions, and what role does behavioral finance play in this? Enphase's strategy involves adapting its offerings to meet the specific needs of various markets and clients. Behavioral finance helps manage risks associated with market fluctuations and changing consumer demands. By understanding market dynamics and client preferences, Enphase can tailor its solutions to remain relevant and competitive. This adaptability is crucial for maintaining a strong market presence and driving growth in a rapidly evolving industry. And this adaptability is essential for Enphase, especially as they face competition from other renewable energy firms. Their ability to stay relevant and responsive to market changes is key to their success. Exactly. Enphase's focus on understanding and adapting to market conditions and client needs helps them stay competitive and maintain a strong market position. Let's compare Enphase Energy to other renewable energy firms like Solar Edge Technologies and First Solar. How do the behavioral finance dynamics differ? Enphase's dynamics are often compared to firms like Solar Edge Technologies and First Solar, particularly in their approach to solar technology and market adaptation. Enphase's focus on managing biases and balancing innovation with risk management aligns it with companies like Solar Edge, known for its advanced solar solutions. First, Solar's emphasis on large-scale solar projects offers a different competitive landscape. Each company, 
approach to managing biases and adapting to market conditions influences their strategies and investor perceptions. Enphase's balance of innovation and practical risk management provides a unique position among these competitors. And unlike Solar Edge's focus on advanced solar technology and First Solar's emphasis on large scale projects, Enphase's strength lies in its comprehensive approach to solar energy and storage solutions, offering a distinct competitive advantage. Absolutely. Each company has its own behavioral finance dynamics that shape investor perceptions and market strategies. Enphase's focus on innovation and practical risk management provides a unique value proposition in the renewable energy sector. To sum up, Enphase Energy's business strategies are influenced by behavioral finance principles, from their approach to managing risks and resources to their DEI efforts and market adaptation. These factors shape their market position and investor appeal. That's right. Understanding these dynamics provides insight into Enphase's strategic decisions and potential risks and rewards for investors. Thanks for joining us on this episode of the Community Corner Podcast. Until next time, I'm Arnav. And I'm Nikhil. Stay curious and keep questioning the narratives. (laughs) 